So, which one is the most reactive metals of them all? Well, there's a very important table that I need you to remember. I call it the reactivity series of metal. And there it goes. It is something like this. Now, it starts with K. So, you have your periodic table with you? Take a look at it. And I'm sure right now, at this juncture, I'm sure you are very familiar. K represents which element? You are right. It actually represents potassium. Now, you have to remember all this in order. K, N, A, C, A, M, G, A, L, Z, and F, E, H, C, U, and A, G. Wow, it's such a mouthful, right? Okay, so I helped you to come up with an acronym that will easily allow you to remember it. Okay, so it goes like this, which is King Nicholas can make apple Zappo for his concubine. Yes, you heard me correctly, concubine. And the name of the concubine is Agong. <laughs> so it goes like this. King Nick can make apple cider for his concubine Agong. Okay, so these are the, you notice, I use the first few letters. Okay, to make sure that you remember them, okay? So this is way to help you remember it, all right? So the letters is uh, synonymous to the symbol, okay? But remember, it cannot just be N, right? Because N is nitrogen. Nitrogen is a non-metal, so it's Na. Now, so besides remembering this table, you're halfway there. What other things? So right now, Another very important thing that you must know is to learn how to separate them into rows and columns, okay? So, wait. Take a look at this first tree. Draw a line. Hydrogen here, you will separate them. And then there will be four columns, okay? First column will be water. And then followed by steam. Followed by dilute acid. And then followed by concentrated Concentrated acid. Okay. So very quickly, it will go like this. Tick, 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 tick. Cross, tick, tick, tick. Cross, cross, tick, tick. Cross, 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 tick. Voila. Very fast. Huh? <laughs> so don't worry. You will get used to it. Now, I want to draw your attention to two very important things. Okay. Now, first of all, water. Question will say water. And sometimes they will use the word cold water. Uh, let me tell you very simply, cold water, water are all water. So just treat it as just plainly water. But one of the main things that you have to take note is steam here. Okay, what exactly is steam? It's actually water, but at 100 degrees Celsius. 100 degrees Celsius, all right? That is steam. So which one is the strongest of this four of them? Water, steam, dilute acid, and concentrated acid. Of course, is concentrated acid all right so how do you make sense of all this tick 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 cross tick 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 cross cross tick tick cross 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 tick don't worry i'm going to explain to you shortly but before that you look over here hydrogen can you see now so besides knowing this entire series okay you must remember this is called reactivity series of metals okay so some of you will be wondering hey but, but, but miss selena how can you have a hydrogen hydrogen is not a matter very good you recognize that okay so wait i will explain this very shortly okay now hydrogen here i want you to remember two more things you need to insert singapore poly s and pb okay so remember the singapore poly s and pb Quickly take out your periodic table. Take a look what is SN. SN actually represent tin. And PB actually represent lead. Okay, I hope you got this down. Tin and lead. All right. So, now how do you make use of, uh, how do you make sense of this tick, tick, tick? Very quickly and easily. If I put a tick here, means that they have reaction with water. Now, like I say just now, this is reactivity series of metal. Once you are up here, means that you are the most powerful. You are the king of the entire reactive series. King ma, so most reactive, correct? So King Nicholas, this potassium is the most reactive, followed by sodium. So out of all this, who is the least reactive? Take a look at it. Very good. It should be what? AG, which is your silver, all right? So, voila, 
This is the beautiful table that is done up. You can see very clearly that these three can react with cold water, steam, dilute acid, and concentrated acid. Of course, this one cannot, no reaction, steam, dilute acid, concentrated acid. Well, um, their reactions will be explained even further for the following videos that you'll be watching. So, uh, at this moment, just remember two things for me, okay? Remember the acronym, okay? Say with me, King Nicholas can, okay, King Nicholas can make apple, zapple, or zider up to you, okay, for his concubine agong. Now, remember, after the his here, always remember to fit in two element. Who are they? They are Singapore Poly S and PV, your teen and your lad. Alright?